Hello YouTube, how's everyone doing? It's Professional here. Welcome back to my playthrough of Saints Row. I'm sorry I haven't uploaded in like three days. I've just been busy with a few things reacting to the GTA trilogy, but now we're back on the road with the Saints Row videos. I know this series is really popular. A lot of people like this one. So we're going to continue from where we left off. Let's do the Vice King's missions now here. Dex, don't worry. I have a plan. Johnny, your idea of a plan is taking the biggest hammer you can find and smashing whatever's in your way. Well, that sounds like a plan to me. Yeah, a shitty one, as your whack-ass robo-leg clearly proves. Oh, fuck you. Next time you try that cowboy shit, you might not walk away at all. No, seriously. Fuck you. Look, I worked out a plan that will hurt the kings and put minimum risk on you. How much murdering do I get to do? None. Your plan blows. Hear me out, all right? King's obviously got something going on with the police. I'll figure that shit out. In the meantime, I want you two to go out and cause some havoc. If we can turn the public's eye to the Kings, then the police won't have a choice but to come down on them. Okay, so we go and do some damage. How did the VKs get blamed? Put these on. I'm yellow enough as it is, Dex. Just put the damn shirt on. Fine. Get dressed. We got a little piece to disturb. All right. If the Vice Kings are gonna take the fall, we gotta make sure that whatever we do is caught on tape. Okay, um, that was a little weird. I couldn't get in the car, but okay, we'll take this what one the? then. But I need Third this Street car. Vice Kings. So we basically gotta go and cause a bunch of chaos. We might as well do that in um uh in Vice King's territory. You okay to drive, man? So I remember this mission now. You, you basically dress up as Vice Kings, and you go and cause a bunch of chaos. <laughs> and the whole point of this mission is to frame the Vice Kings, because Ben King um, is um, working with Chief Monroe, who's the corrupt chief of police in Stillwater. And so basically, the Vice Kings have the police on their payroll. That's why the police never come down on them. Okay, we need some more police attention. There we go. Yeah, I just have this pistol right now, so I don't got that much, but, um... I get a little bit more police attention. You see this yellow? That means I'm a vice king. I need more money. The first thing we're gonna do is put a couple of stores. Oh, and there's the media. Okay, so that's basically it. We want the media to follow us and to frame the Vice Kings for what we're doing right now. Wanna keep the wanted level up too. And watch where you're going. Time to stop up. Cop car is actually one of the fastest cars in the game. Okay, we're in downtown now. Oh, I see. Okay. We're going to um, Tanya's favorite store right now, then. Gotta keep that wanted level up. They were resisting arrest. Good thing I remember these shortcuts here, even though these aren't part of the street. Could you not um, get us killed, please? Ah. Damn. Woo! This neighborhood is going to hell. Watch it, you nearly killed me! Please don't loiter, I'm very busy. Oh! 
Since we're back here, might as well hit the safe, too. Ah. Yeah, this, this, you gotta time this really well. There we go. And we got some money while we're at it. Oh, we don't want to kill the reporters. Okay, next door we're gonna hit now. Oh, about to abandon Johnny. We're putting you away, punk. We won't let you get away with it. Fuck it, we can steal another one. Okay, there. Wow, Johnny got. Uh, Johnny got in the car pretty quickly. Okay, we got some footage. Okay, next door. Oh. Johnny got run over. You go to the mall. I've got visual on the perp. Okay, might as well hit the safe in this store too. Do they have a safe in here? No, it doesn't look like it. Uh -huh. right there. You're under arrest. Take him down. Take him down. Oh no, not Wait. That's some aggressive media. What? There's expensive equipment in there. You did that to make the Vice Kings look bad, right? And you know, see what Johnny's doing right there? I I just love that Are about okay the dive, um, man? about the um, old Saints Row games, old, or Saints Row I should say specifically. I like that like NPCs can fire shotguns, assault rifles Shit, out the window, man, where you um, going? Uh, and even an RPG. Like, um, uh, and I can understand if you're the driver, you shouldn't be able to fire that out the window. You shouldn't, um, uh, because it's, it doesn't make sense firing an assault rifle while you're driving. But if you're the passenger, you should be able to. And that's what I never understood about the Grand Theft Auto games. Like, why can you not do a drive-by in a GTA game with an AK-47 if you're the passenger? I never understood that. Could you not get us killed, please? Okay, yeah, the police, uh, the police in Saints Row are a bit aggressive, one. like the old GTA games. Um, ah, uh, damn. So that's, you, you know... You did that to make the Vice Kings look bad, right? Okay, let's... Yo, let's hit that ramp and knock those pins out. You okay to drive, man? Damn, look at this right now. Look at the, yeah, the you police. You never should have messed with the Saints. Or, or, or the Vice Kings, because that's what we are. Because that's what we are. Okay, one more thing. Let's find the bulldozer. This is gonna be die if we do. Get a bulldozer, okay. This neighborhood is going to And so, like, you know, when you have those people that just Shit, say, oh, Saints, going? the old Saints Row games are a GTA clone, you know, it's a competitor. It's not a clone. And that's one thing that Saints Row did better than GTA. Passengers can use assault rifles when they drive by. Can't do that in a GTA game. You, I'm out of here. Bulldozer, here we go. It's gonna be good. Oh, music CD. Let's get it. Okay, what do I do with this? I'm getting real sick of hearing Hughes run his mouth. I think it's time to thank him for his gift to Stillwater. Get behind the statue of Alderman Hughes. Oh, I see. Okay. This is gonna be good now. Well, that's definitely going to put some hurting on the Vice Kings now. 
Don't worry about it. Look, if it was one of mine, I'll take care of it. But I'm telling you, I don't care what colors they was wearing. It was that crew from Saints Row I was telling you about. No, I'm not making any excuse. I will. Tell your wife I said hello. Goodbye, Alderman. Great. Now we got your crack-ass friends tripping. Like I said, fucking with City Hall is a waste of time. Wrong. Working with them is what gives us power. Yo, fuck that. This is what gives us power. Now get the fuck out of my office. That's what I like about Ben King. Ben King is a very smart gang boss. He is probably the smartest gang boss in the entire Saints Row series. Um, uh, so yeah, he's the smartest rival gang boss in the entire Saints Row series. Um, that's what I like about him a lot. He's um, uh, he works with City Hall. He has corrupt politicians on his payroll. He has the chief of police on his payroll. He controls what his gang does so that his gang doesn't get that much attention. <laughs> He tries to put his gang into legitimate, um, businesses like the, um, uh, the record music, but they also extort artists there. Oh, God. oh here we go. It should be What's a good one. Dad? Get a lot of money from this. Oh, Jesus! Hostage. This okay. is my retirement money! So you just basically drive, uh, for like a minute, you get like $500 or however much, um, there. And I'm also- I also owe the Mafia a lot of money, Why so I haven't paid the Mafia this? back, so it's... Your parents should be ashamed. I think I need to change my pants. Oh, it, 30 seconds, uh, 25 seconds. Why don't you let me out and you just take the car? You almost killed me. Ah, I had to carpool today, didn't I? I had to carpool today, didn't I? Well, these games, they used to be still pretty funny, had some funny dialogue um, in them, but they were still very much serious, so I liked about them. Take it! Now let me go! There we go. Okay. We got that done. Help! I can't believe that almost hit me! We got another Hitman activity here. An offer they can't refuse. I'm glad you could make it. One of my niggas is in trouble and I need you to help. He's got a big court case coming up and the prosecutor has a whole line of witnesses that could put him away. Well, needless to say, that ain't gonna happen. I got a list of all the witnesses and I'll pay you for each one you can take out. That's straight with you? Okay, so a lot of witnesses um, here. Let's see. Listen, motherfucker, if you come by here one more time, no. If you look at this fucking building one more time, I will personally feed you all three inches of your cock. You hear me? Now get the fuck out. I don't know what you want, but whatever it is, I ain't got it. Look around, hun. I think you'll notice a distinct lack of pussy. Some fucking pimps from out of town are trying to put me out of business. They took most of my stable, and now they're even asking me to go back hoeing for them. You believe that shit? Until you can go out there and bring my girls back, I can't help you. Oh, we have a hitman target here, too? Who is this? Oh, but we don't have the appropriate weapon. That guy needs to be taken out with a revolver. Okay. At least Vicky gave me a safe work environment. What the 
These missions is basically, you know, you just pick you the girls up and you drop food. them off. Um, it's pretty easy to get respect from these. Level two? Okay. Oh, shit. This is going as well as my first time. I haven't been this since I waited. your way, like big guy. All right, because we're doing this in Vice King's territory. They're not too happy. Okay. Let's get out of that there. Why are you trying to kill me? Here we got a stronghold. Let's do this. So strongholds, these are basically like gang fortresses. Um, Some of Warren Williams' crew is gonna be meeting to discuss getting in on the drug trade. Show those bitches why they shouldn't fuck with our business. So um, uh, this um, uh, these uh, these like strongholds. Um, like I was saying, these are basically big like gang fortresses. They don't really have like a cutscene in them. You just have like specific objectives, but they're part of like the gang storyline. And so in this case, you heard that Warren is actually going against, he's the underboss for the Vice Kings. He's going against um, uh, Ben King's um, instructions not to get into, not to get into drugs. But Warren doesn't care. I'm running out of ammo myself. Um, let's use a shotgun. you like popping caps, huh? Bro, you in the last five minutes already. So we got your ass. You can snap. Okay, fought our way across the street. Saints! Damn, he's wasn't fucking around when he said you were hard. Get to the fire escape. Okay, let's do this. Shotgun was definitely a good choice in this situation. Good thing I brought backup with me too. Oh, look at this—a sniper rifle. I'm not becoming a statistic. How do I zoom in? Oh, oh no, wow. Okay, wow, they are just... Wow, that was just, they were so accurate. Okay, we retry this now, we take out the Vice Kings. And now, the thing is, um, Saints Row is a very weird yeah. zooming feature. The reason that I wasn't able to uh, figure it out before is because you had to hit the aiming button. So it's Lily, um, LT. <laughs> Back here, we ain't through yet. Ah! This one is in a bit of an annoying piece of cover. Oh, looks like we got more coming in. Yep, no RPG for you. Ah. 
Oh god, they got an RPG. Okay, yeah, gotta take that down. Oh! Damn. Oh my god! Get out of here with that. Oh my god, take cover. <laughs> my god, my stress levels are about to jump with that art damn RPG. That's the best you got. Okay. I love the McManus as the sniper rifle. No, you didn't just This one's gotta have a sniper rifle because they're hitting me from far range. Got him. Now we can have up to two homies. There we go. Who's that? I think you better pay up. Oh no, it's the mafia. Yep. So that's what happens if you don't pay your loan. They'll constantly keep coming after you. Damn. What's happening? Okay, let's try out this activity here. Demolition Derby. Are you crazy, man? The Derby's about to start. If you're just standing around out here. You could get really hurt. Woo! Don't mind my brother. He's just being a pussy. Hop in a car, man. There ain't nothing better than smashing cars for money. Complete in nine car demolition to restore your opponent's cars to earn money. Three, in two, one, go! Yeah! Wreck one car to win the derby. Okay. Yeah, I can see how this activity can get hard. Oh wow. So the moment your car gets blown up, you um uh you fail. Okay, um Three, two, one, go! Yeah! Oh, damn, I'm trying to hit that white car, but I keep getting smashed by other cars in the way. No, uh... Okay, wow, I got it. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna do that activity again. Um, I don't like that, um... Okay, it looks like the cops been getting in on some of King's protection rackets. Now that's why they've been going so easy on the VKs. We gotta go public with this shit. Now if we- Don't worry, Dex. I have something more subtle in mind. RPGs. Johnny, you can't be serious. Fuck yeah, I am. Where did you get those? Anthony's condo. He had a big mouth. This isn't gonna end well. Don't listen to the old woman. I'll drive to where the cops are picking up protection money. You make them cease and desist with one of Tony's noisemakers. If we make sure the only cops we hit are the ones working for King, people are gonna start asking questions, and the cops are gonna have no choice but to come down on the VKs to save face. Let's do this. Oh, go. Uh, okay, so we got unlimited ammo, limited rockets, AK ammo too. Nice, unlimited everything. So basically what we're doing here now 
is that Johnny's plan is to basically go and um, ambush the uh, the vice kings that are meeting with the corrupt cops and just cause a lot of damage. So the other day, them, Aisha's giving me shit because I don't do anything nice for her. Can you believe that? I mean, I pay for her every time we go out. So I'm like, what the hell are you talking about? I picked up the check at the firing range. And she goes on and on, dinner this, flowers that. It's fucking bullshit, right? Yeah, thanks for your advice, man. You're a big help. <laughs> it doesn't even talk. Uh, thanks for your advice. Just okay, we're coming up on one of the meetings. Interrupt the meeting between the cops and the vice king. Are you sure you know how to handle that thing? That's, like I said earlier, this is what I love about the old Saints Row games, that you can just fire an Look, assault yeah, rifle let's not and even an RPG out the window. Right away. Woo! Uh, let's do a drive-by of an RPG next. Get that bad boy ready. There's a meet up ahead. Oh, gas station. This is gonna be perfect. So bitch. Time to say hello to Stillwater's finest. Oh. Man, we should do this every week. Hey, next time, I call dibs on the RPG. Let's take care of these guys next. Drop it. Ah, ah, Early retirement, baby. Whoa, Time whoa. to visit Mike and Dan again. You goddamn drunk. Another payoff is going down up ahead. What do you say we crashed their little meeting? Oh, it's your day. Oh, that was fucking sweet! The, both the cops and the vice kings are after us. You ready to send a us. message to Monroe and King? This day just keeps getting better and better. Whoa, whoa, they no have an shot, RPG man. too? So, so pretty. Mm. But that takes care of the cops. Let's stop by Forgive and Forget before we give our last little present to the Vice Kings. Oh, great. Oh, good. Okay, the AI can go around roadblocks. That's what's good. Driving AI is actually pretty smart. Sometimes they'll crash, but they will correct themselves. Oh, God. Where'd that come from? Damn, I changed the license plate again. Wait, wait, wait. I'm trying to get a shot here. There we go. We're almost at forgive and forget, but our car's so trashed. Oh, damn. Okay, Johnny, get in there quick. Ooh, okay. We did it. Now, this is going to be good. They're taking it back to the destroyed record studio. I think the kings are through with the policeman's balls. Now all we got left to do is give Warren a nice final fuck you, and I'd say this has been a hell of a day. Now this cutscene is gonna be really good, um... Hello? Hey, it's good to hear from... What? Wait, wait, slow down. What are you saying? Look, our arrangement has been beneficial for both parties. Look, why don't we talk about this tonight over dinner? I'm sure we can work this out, okay? Alright. See you tonight. Goodbye. See? This is what I'm talking about! Who said you could come in here? We need to talk. Do we now? You've been putting yourself before the crew. Keep talking, little nigga. If you hadn't wasted our time sticking your nose up them white boys' asses, we could have owned the whole damn game by now. I told you before, we ain't getting into that shit. He's and talking about drugs. Not? That's where the money is? Man, if you got done with that shit back in the day, the Carnales would have been ghosts right now. But you didn't, did you? You were too much of a pussy then. And you're too much of a pussy now. Fuck! 
You forgot who you talking to. My name is Benjamin motherfucking King. I'm the man who took my crew from being a bunch of baby gangsters in Sunnyvale to being one of the most influential and feared forces in the goddamn city. You know how I did that? I said you know how I did how, that? Mr. King? I did it by knowing when it was time to build, when it was time to watch, and when it was time to act. I'm through carrying your punk ass. If I were you, I'd drop them damn flags and get the fuck out of here before I erase your ass. I ain't going nowhere. You ain't hearing me, son. I said... Yo, fuck that. You ain't hearing me. What is this? I built, I watched, and now I'm acting. So, um, uh, Benjamin King has been betrayed by Tanya and Warren, who were constantly plotting against him. So, and the thing is, though, is if, if Warren and Tanya had actually listened to the, to Ben, Ben King, they could have done some serious damage to the Saints. Um, uh, but, um, Ben, but they were just being impatient, they were being stupid, and notice how Warren said, um, uh, that, uh, Warren was talking about drugs, and Ben King said, we're not getting into that. Because he wants to keep the, um, uh, I guess he probably has a moral thing against drugs. And he also wants to keep his gang clear of that, because it's going to bring more problems for them. And he's working with City Hall and with the police. And so he doesn't want his gang involved in drugs. He's a very smart gang boss. Um, uh, but Warren and Tanya are pretty stupid, and they're constantly that. plotting against you them. And now they've betrayed him. So I hope you guys enjoy this. I'll show you guys what happens in the next part. It's going to get good in the Vice King storyline. So thank you guys for watching. Vice Kings are my favorite rival gang in Saints Row 1. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one. Take care, everyone. Bitch, y'all know me, me. Mississippi hoe, I'm a real OG.